Everyone, welcome back to another exciting episode of Screaming Chewy Show. And I'd like to welcome Jeremy. Yo, yo, yo. yo. What, what up, what up Jeremy? What up, what up? What's going on, babe? Pretty good, man. I'm pretty fucking excited. I mean, uh, anybody watching this, I mean, uh, pretty sure you get pretty fucking excited as well. It looks delicious. And Jeremy, why don't you tell me about yourself? Tell me about your business, man. Oh man, hey man, my name is Jeremy Roberts, man. I'm um, I'm originally from Texas, man. I moved out here to Arizona about four years ago. Started this little business right here called Desert Daiquiri about a year ago, man. I'm a delivery service out here in Tucson. You guys, you guys just check me out, man, on Facebook. Desert Daiquiri on Facebook. I'm on Instagram at Desert Daiquiri five two zero. You know, you guys uh, check me out. I have my number, uh, 520-261-6658. You know, you guys just hit me up on that, man. I just want to start this off, man. I got these candies on it. Yeah, you know, tell I me about this, this, man. I mean, what? You know, I made it real. Man, this one right here, man, is uh, is my blue raspberry flavor right here, man. I call this one the monsoon right here. The monsoon. monsoon. Look at that. <laughs> Delish. <laughs> All right, we're gonna go to this one right here. This right here is a specialty drink right here, man. I call this one right here the Zona Sunset. The Zona Sunset, Zona huh? Sunset, man. It comes with your uh, chamoy and your tahini on there. Oh yeah, man. That, that is so is this man. like a, a version of the mangonada or banguela? Yeah, like a version of that. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Damn, man. <laughs> You love them candies too, or is that the peach and uh, some lollipops, yeah, right? Lollipops oh, there, look man. at that, the Mexican yeah. lollipops. Exactly. Look at this. Yeah. <laughs> I try to try to keep it all in that little same thing, you know, going that same thing with it, you know, with the sour candies. See, look at these like candies that. right here. You got the rainbows, some nerds in there, right? Yeah, that's some the gummy worms. Yeah. Some frosty and fucking refreshing <laughs> for this Arizona heat. I mean, you can't beat that, bro. And it's alcoholic, right? And it's alcoholic, yeah. yeah it is alcoholic. Look at this guy. Look at this. We do do non-alcoholic drinks, though. We do supply non-alcoholic drinks for your kids, for the people who don't drink. So we do have that. So a little bit for everybody, right? Yeah, for exactly. the parties? A bit for everyone. Yeah, yeah exactly, man. Right? And then, uh, what about this guy? What am I looking this at? This right here, man, is, um, I just added this one right here. It's like a little limited flavor. It's called, it's the fruit punch one. This is fruit punch. So this is the new guy right here, limited edition? One new, yeah, one of the limited editions, man. I added this one. Uh, we have six flavors, man. I added three more. So, and that is a mix of nine. I added that one right there with the fruit punch. I added a pina colada and a uh, pink lemonade. Pina Colada and Pink Lemonade. Pink lemonade, man. We have six flavors, man. We have grape, we have cherry, strawberry, we have uh, the mango, of course. We have um, blue raspberry, of course. You know, we have sour apple, cherry. So, yeah, we have a And do you do also <laughs> customizable? Like if they say, hey, I want different candy or yeah. something? Or Yes, yes. You know, you know just uh, be specific, you know, when you do order. You know, just tell us what you guys want on it. Because it comes with the candy on there already, but if you want different things on there, yeah, just let us know. We will hook you up on. And of course, they come with candies on the side as yes, well. Yes, these are the straws that comes with the regular drinks. Like this oh, it's one. a straw. Yes, yes, those are the straws that come with the regular drink when you get it. This one right here actually comes with this one right there. So you get this with that. <laughs> Let's open this guy up if you don't mind. That way they no, no, they, no, they see what's see going it. on here. Look at this. So it's tamarindo, right? Yeah, yeah, that's exactly what it is. The tamarindo stick. So like I say, man, you gotta keep it all in theme, all in theme, all in theme here. Yeah, you got it down, bro. This is like <laughs> a science right here, man. <laughs> See, this is exactly what you do right here, man. Look at that. That's fucking sexy right there. So tamarindo as a straw. Look at this. <laughs> And then this guy, it's got um, lifesaver candy, life right? Lifesaver candies on it. On the straw. On the straw. Look at this. So everyone, check these guys out. Desert Daiquiris on Facebook and uh, we're on Instagram as well, man. Instagram Desert Daiquiri five two zero on Instagram. Desert Daiquiris. On Facebook, man. Check us out, man. Number is uh, our number again, man. You can text us. Uh, we are open on Fridays, Saturdays, Sundays, man. Fridays after five, 
Saturdays anytime, man. Sundays a little bit uh, in, in the morning times, a little bit on, in the morning on Sundays, man. But text us, man, at 520-261-6658. Yeah, man, just get at us, man. So everybody call in and get them orders up, and you guys deliver, which is yeah. also freaking amazing. Yeah, we do deliver, so yeah, just, hey. Just, that's another little, you know, you know, addition to that. You know, everybody loves that. Keeping it safe, right? <laughs> you know, exactly. stay away from that drinking and driving. Exactly. You're saving Trying lives, bro. Everyone safe out there will come to you. You know what I'm saying? So, and get you, get you nice and good for the night or for the day. And staying cool in this desert heat with these amazing exactly. drinks and getting tipsy. <laughs> <laughs> so, thanks again, bro. No problem, man. Thank you, brother. Thank you. All right, everyone, welcome back to another exciting episode of Screaming Chewy Show. I'm joined again by special guest Juanito. Yeah, yeah. And uh, we're doing another foodie episode, uh, food review. It's actually not food, it's actually uh, daiquiris, right? Frozen flavored alcoholic beverages. Um, fucking delicious. This is uh, Today's episode is brought to you by uh, Desert Daiquiris. You can check them out on Facebook, Instagram, and um, I'll hook you up with his uh, number at the end of this episode because uh, I haven't, uh, <laughs> I actually forgot. <laughs> I, I think I can pull it up right quick. Yeah, let's mm -hmm. put a little well, real quick. But uh, for those of you listening, you should really check this out on YouTube. This audio will not do it justice. I mean, look at this freaking delicious over here. Um, yes, these flavors are amazing. Um, and I'm excited to try these. That's a great candy on them. So his phone number is 520-261-6658. Make sure to text only. And um, his hours are Fridays, um, 5 p.m. to 12 a.m. Desert daiquiris. And the flavors are um, Cactus Jack, Monsoon, Snake's Blood, Mountain Lion, Gila Monster, Scorpion, Green, and uh, so so basically the Cactus Jack is Green Apple, Monsoon is Blue Raspberry, which we have here. Then we have the Snake's Blood, which is Cherry. Then the Mountain Lion, which is Mango flavor, like the Mango Mango Yada, if you, you guys visited Mangos or Raspados. The Gila Monster, which is Grape, and the Scorpion, which is Strawberry. Now today we have a brand new flavor here, which is Fruit Punch. And um, yeah, we're gonna try it out. Two of them. Remember, he said this one wasn't the Mangoyala. This was the Arizona Sunset or the Zona Sunset. You're right. Because he said it was a special one, because he puts a little extra alcohol in this one with tahini and some other stuff. So I think the two that we have there are two of the newer mm. ones that are not on the menu yet, but we'll represent them here today. See, Juanito's on this, bro. You I know, know and I don't even do podcasts. Bro. Right, you're natural. Yeah. <laughs> so, Got many things. are you ready for this? I'm down, bro. Let's do this. So this is the monsoon, right? The, mm -hmm. the monsoon, the yeah. blueberry flavor. Um, so you got, you see, some nerds candies. Um, let's put this up to the camera real quick. Right now, look at that, right there. This, uh, you know, because with a straw and it's got these lifesaver candies around it. Um, it's got those rainbow gummies, sour gummies, uh, sour um, gummy worms and nerds on it. And a blue raspberry slushy with uh, rum. Uh, I believe it's two shots in each drink. They're a little bit melted, uh, you know, we're in the Arizona heat. Oh, we're going to try this, man. You ready? You want to you want, yeah. you want be, be the first guy, man? Let's do this. Well, I think we can't fit the spoons through there. And then we can't open it because... We're going to have to put it in a cup. We're going to have to put it in a cup. We'll be right back. <laughs> some, oh, there's some right there on top of the... We're, we're prepared for this, guys. There you go. Let's do this. So it doesn't look as beautiful pouring it into a solo cup. We're going to make it ghetto. I mean, um, this is like a work of art, bro. I mean, let me pour some more juice out. I almost don't want to like dig into it just because it looks so freaking beautiful. If you want to get, oh, we'll put more juice here and then some juice, and then we'll like 
once the juice is gone, we'll put some of the ice in there. It smells pretty, pretty um, strong. So that's a good sign. All right, we can dig in. Yeah. Oh, it smells delicious. I know. You could smell the alcohol, but it doesn't like overpowered. smell overpowered. You know. Oh wow, it's got a nerds rope in it. Like that was the individual candies. We'll probably have to like cut that or something. Or if you want to oh. grab that half. Okay, I'll tear it a little bit. Yeah. Like a, like a vagina tear it up. <laughs> this is like the reverse of a wishbone with a yeah. nerds rope. Like fat diabetes. Fat diabetes. <laughs> No, it's pretty good. I'm gonna grab more just because I wanna be fuzzy. Kitty. You want some of these lifesavers? No, I'm good. I think I have enough candy up in here. Too much candy? No. There's no way. There's no such thing as too much candy. So I'm gonna put these in the drink, put the lifesavers in there, mix it up very well. I'm gonna get one of these real quick. Throw that in there. All right, so I'm gonna get some, gonna get a gummy worm in there. We're probably gonna have to do this for each drink. It's a good thing that we have some cups there. All right. So I'm gonna smell it like a fine wine. It definitely has that raspberry smell to it. Um, Blueberry. Ready for a taste? Yeah. Wow. Oh yeah, that tastes really good. Wow, so yeah, you could taste that rum in there. But it's not like too over, it's like perfect, I think. It is, it's very good mixture. And it's not like some drinks where the alcohol sits at the bottom. This is very well mixed. Um, let's try it with the candy, let's mix it up. Let's do that. If I can find it. So I'm gonna get a scoop here oh, with a raspberry daiquiri with the nerds. We're gonna die diabetes. Diabetes. Well, it definitely changes the flavor of the nerds robe itself. Wow, really good. Raspberry nerds. <laughs> I can already tell this is gonna get me really fucked up. So that was a rainbow gummy? That's just really good with the rainbow gummy. So, Desert Daiquiri's Monsoon. Um, it's got rainbow gummies, Nerds Rope, and um, Lifesavers. Here's a Lifesaver. Now these candies that are put in, they mix really well. And uh, it's pretty bomb. You can taste the alcohol, but like I said, it's not very, like Juan said, it's not strong to the point where it affects the flavor in a negative way. I'm gonna get a brain freeze if you do that. <laughs> but it's pretty bomb. Yeah. Delicious. Um, What do you rate it, bro? Um, Zero bean. I absolutely hate it. I would never try this ever again. Ten is I love it. Um, I want this every day. I need this in my life. I think I need this in my life. Number ten. Number ten, bro. Definitely. I see. I'm gonna take a little drink out of it. Oh, the alcohol settling. Mm. That's pretty good. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> See, that's the problem with when, when it's so delicious and it's cold. Um, 
You just want to drink it really fast. <laughs> um, this is delicious. Uh, so the desert daiquiri is monsoon flavored. Um, months well, the name is monsoon. It's raspberry flavored. Um, I give it. Um, wow. Okay, I'm gonna try it with the gummy worm because I tried it with all the candies, but except the gummy worm. You know, I give this an 8 out of 10 because amazing flavor. Um, the candies go along with it perfectly. Um, the alcohol content, I believe it's two shots per drink. Um, mixed in very well. All the flavor combinations are, they go really good. Um, with the raspberry flavoring, um, but the candy, even though I love gummies, um, I like Mexican candy better. I think that's why I didn't give it a 10. Cause you're just waiting for the other one. Yeah, probably. <laughs> I think we all are. I think that but, was something that we all are. But I really do love this flavor. I mean, cause I... I love like blue Gatorade, raspberry stuff, or green apple. That's my favorite. That's my go-to. Uh, monsoon, desert daiquiri. I give it an eight out of ten. It's pretty freaking amazing. Um, want to move on to the next one? Let's move on to the next one. Average rating is a nine for all those math people out there. <laughs> all right, so. This is the Zona Sunset, right? Yes, sir. So that one has a little bit more of the liqueur. Um, it has tahine, mango. He said he also added something else. I think it was like piña. I don't know. It's just really good. He said they just came up with this one. Um, so I don't know if you want to talk about price, but he says all, the, all this size comes at $9. This specific one is $11.00. Not only because it has the extra shot, but it has little extra things here and there. And like I know it has like, I think it's piña. Um, it has the mango. It has the tahini. Chamoy. And chamoy, yeah. So it has all that in that one. So it looks pretty delicious, actually. And of course, it's got Mexican candy. It's got two lollipops here. The mango with chile. It's got the peach rings and it's got the tamarindo as a straw i mean and then it also has i don't know what that is right there but it looks like a hard candy hard candy oh yeah it does look like like it's probably like mango or some sort of like piña something but really, i'm pretty sure it's pretty good so let's get this going man let's get it same one I'm excited for this one. Like I said, I fucking love Mexican candy. I think this is gonna be. And our apologies, it, it's a little bit melted. We we waited a little bit for the setup and we should have done this earlier, but I mean, it's still delicious. I mean. I know it probably don't sound right in the audio part, but this is me pouring the juice in the cup for a sample. <laughs> but like I said, for those of you listening, I mean, um, I really do recommend you watch this on YouTube. Uh, the audio is not gonna be as great because it's gonna be from the GoPro. So those of you listening, the audio is better because it's from the mics. Anywho, you need a visual on this. These drinks look amazing it's it's like a work of art man i mean like i said it, it's a shame to like dig into them because they just look so good <laughs> but let's see let's take a wood frame Ooh. oh dude what's it what does it smell like it doesn't tamarindo. that's what it is yeah he added tamarindo to it so it's it's very different from a do you guys want this? Mm -hmm. I know Carla wants some. No, I try it. I don't want that candy. Okay. Mm 
And I'm gonna grab a lollipop. Grab a Mexican lolly. Lollipop. Sing it, bro. Sing it. I don't know the whole thing, so that's all we're getting today. So I'm gonna get a little peach ring right here. We'll get a lolly with it. Oh, it's the mango chile. Oh, so the tamarindo or whatever was on there already fell into this. All right, guys, so this is the Rona Sunset. Zona. Oh, Zona. <laughs> My bad. I, did Rona? I say Rona? Yeah. Oh, Rona virus. Damn, a 2020 drink for real. <laughs> no Rona on these drinks, guys. My apologies. <laughs> I'm fucked up. <laughs> the Rona Sunset. The Zona Sunset, you know, hence for Arizona. Oh, wow, this smells delicious. It does. It smells just like Mexican candy. Like. Yeah, I'm gonna taste it. Get a little piece of fruit. Oh my god. It's Damn. pretty bomb. This and I don't really like mango fruit, but, but it's pretty good. Oh my god. Oh, I already know the score on this one. I already know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so for flavor, um, wow, this is perfect combination. It is. It's really. I mean, he said he put extra alcohol. He mixed it so well that it still has that really good balance to it. Still, it's really, really nice. And the candies to go with it. Um, the peach rings with the tamarindo, tamarindo and mango. Wow, amazing. Um. The drink to me, even though it's a mango, I believe it has a tahini and chamoy and these candies. The drink itself reminds, it tastes just like the paleta. It does, yeah. The drink itself, it tastes just like a mango, chile, Mexican lollipop. It, that's exactly what this slushy tastes like. So if you get that flavor and put it in a, in a icy and alcoholic, oh, wow, this is amazing. Oh my god. <laughs> it's amazing. This is my favorite so far. I give it a 10 out of 10. I give it a 10. So, uh, How zero. How about you guys? 10. 10 out of 10. 10, 10 plus. 10 plus. So, I think everybody likes that one. So, four Pop people, it. we all rate it 10. I mean, wow. So, Desert Daiquiris, amazing job, guys. Uh, the Zona Sunset. Um, Zona Sunset. I need this in my life. <laughs> like every day. <laughs> Waking up and going Not to the sleep. Rona. <laughs> Not the Rona Sunset, but the Zona Sunset. I mean, you could probably legit take this to work. And be like, hey dude, it's, it's a... It's a mangoyara, bro. It's a slushy. <laughs> Does it have alcohol? What? It's like, candy, bro. You really think it's going to be alcohol and candy? And you know I'm I'm not promoting alcoholism here, but also you could get these non-alcoholic if you if you would like that because just I mean just looking at them is enticing. You know, if you want kids or anything, you know, they can have non-alcoholic. I mean, I mean, or you can ask them with a little bit of Benadryl to put them to sleep. No, I'm kidding. I can't do that. <laughs> <laughs> Might as well put alcohol. <laughs> so this one is the fruit punch. I've been wanting to. This was one of his new ones. He said also that he just mixed because it's not only fruit punch. He said it was like fruit punch, um, like sour, chili, right? Yeah, sour apple and I'm not sure. I'm pretty sure he'll let us know later. But I know it's a couple of mostly fruit punch though. I've been waiting to try this one too. This one looks pretty bomb. I give you a cup. Dizzle. So fruit punch. It's got um, you know it's a red slushy. Um, they're all mixed with the same white rum, which is amazing because it goes with everything. Um, like vodka goes with a lot of things, but it has that vodka taste to it still. Taste, yeah. Um, I, I really do like this rum. And uh, so this is a fruit punch slushy or daiquiri with uh, sour gummy worms. 
Yes, you know. Okay, I can smell that fruit punch in it. Smells like that um the high C fruit punch drink. There you go. The adult version. The adult version. Wow, so far I'm pretty impressed with these drinks. I mean I really really like this one, how it smells. And like I said, this one we're trying right now, uh fruit punch. It's a brand new flavor. Um it's not in the menu, but if you ask for it, you will make it. Just tell them it's a fruit punch drink you guys saw on Screaming Chewy's podcast or YouTube channel. Tell them Screaming Chewy sent you. Find them on Facebook and Insta. On Instagram, I believe is, uh, uh, what is it? Um, Desert Daiquiris 520 on Instagram. All right. So you ready for this? I'm ready. So I'm gonna try the first scoop with just a slushy by itself. Well, I can't taste the alcohol at all in this one. No, oh, this one's pretty bomb. It like tastes it. just like fruit punch. I cannot taste the alcohol in this one. Wow. Going with the, the sour, candy. With the candy, sour gummy worm. Where can I find this? Where is it? Oh. Keeps getting away from I me, bro, like a real worm. Yeah. Wow. What's good with it? Damn, I really loved the last one, but this one's amazing as well. Yeah, this <laughs> one's really good. Um, damn. You know, and I'm not just trying to give them high scores here, just like to hook them up or make them look good. These are legit opinions, and I mean, I'm not disappointed. This is amazing. Um, damn. If you don't believe me, try it for yourself. Oh, it's another you type of candy here. <laughs> you want to go no. So this is not a gummy worm. I don't know what it is. Ever seen these candies before? It's like a blue little tube. Mm. No, at first I thought they were Jolly Ranchers, but it's not a hard candy. It's a gummy. Mm. It's like blue raspberry type of. Yeah, sour gummy. it's really good though. They all go. It complements it like really well. Yeah, cause the sour gummies are red and blue, so they're like strawberry and. Uh, Blueberry mix. And the good thing is, like, what well, good and bad thing about this is that it's really, really good. Um, you can't taste the alcohol. The good thing, the bad thing is, you can't taste the alcohol. <laughs> You're fucked up in a hurry. <laughs> so, if you want to get lit, Desert Daiquiris got your back. And, um, wow, this is, wow, I cannot taste the alcohol on this. Yeah, I think I like this one. I mean, I like all of them, but this one's probably my favorite. Oh my god. Yeah, like I mentioned, um, the one before the Zona Sunset, 10 out of 10. Uh, I'm gonna give this one a 10 out of 10 as well, dude. Oh, I got a break for this. I, I'll agree. I'll give this one a 10 out of 10. Oh. I, think I mean, I remember from the mangoes. If you guys remember me from the mangoes, we tried the mango stuff. I'm really not a mango guy. I like mangoes. That one was really, really good. I think it's just the candy stuff that adds to it, and I like this one better than mangoes. Mangoes is just regular stuff. But this one's really, really good. I think this one would be my favorite if I like order something. I think this one would be the one I order. Personally, like I said, it's opinions. I like prefer this one. I really like this one. So you, uh, your favorite out of the three, three which was the monsoon, the Zona Sunset and Fruit Punch, right? Is there, Your favorite is uh, Fruit Punch? It is. Wow. I think Fruit Punch is amazing, but uh, I want to go with uh, my favorite is the Zona Sunset. Zona Sunset. I mean, that was pretty, that's pretty close. Is that we're both like really close. But I think I like this one. Like I said, it's not, it's just I'm not a mango guy. Like I don't eat mango. You don't like the fruit yeah. itself. So I would go with something like Fruit Punch because it has more like 
buried yeah. type background and it does like and i was impressed with the zone of sunset because i expected it to taste just like a mango yada you know because a, a lot of places are trying to re replicate that exact same recipe which is mango chamoy tahine and mexican candy and we could taste a lot of the mango and the chamoy is very overpowering and yeah and that but in this one the ratio is like perfect on all of them so perfect. it makes it taste like really really good and it's yeah. pretty cool because i mean i know there's mexicans in texas but you know for them to get it down like that you know that good i mean that, i'm impressed for sure man because you know jeremy ceo of uh desert daiquiris this guy knows what he's doing he does um and you don't have to believe me try them for yourself hit them up on facebook desert daiquiris instagram and uh his phone number um his phone number real quick really quick just okay. pulling it up <laughs> right there so if you guys uh like to hit him up you know, on Insta is Desert Daiquiris 520. On Facebook, it's just Desert Daiquiris. Of course, you know, call them up. They take orders. They take party packs. You know, there's specials, you know, non-alcoholics. You could ask for the alcohol on the side. Um, you know, Customize the candy. He said you just have to be specific with the candy that you want on them. It doesn't specifically have to be the ones that you saw today. But if, let's say, you wanted, like, the Nerds Rope instead of, like, the... I don't know, like the, what is it, the peach rings or something like that. You just have to be specific with it. I think he said the half a gallon is $22 on, on the flavors. So a whole gallon would be 44 bucks, which is not bad because, you know, it's already mixed. He has the formula down. Thanks, Everything's dude. really good. So you can go ahead and, um, you know, for 22 bucks, I mean, you buy a bottle and it's just the bottle. Then yeah. you have to do your own mixing, and if you get it wrong, it's either too strong or not strong enough. You just you fucked know. up a whole batch. <laughs> yeah, there you go. And you just call them up, be like, hey, you know what? Let me have that half a gallon, you know, or the full gallon if you're down, you know. Um, the formula's already done, and everything's just already set for you guys to drink. And which is what we'll be doing tonight. I mean, probably, well, I'm 100% sure. Because, <laughs> I mean, we're going to have a party tonight, and... Uh, these desert daiquiris, I'm pretty sure everybody's going to absolutely love them. I think that's all we're going to be drinking. <laughs> and, like, you know, so if you're a person that loves daiquiris, you love slushies, you love candies, uh, this is it. I mean, how can you not love these, okay? So hit them up. It's Fridays from 5 p.m. to 12 a.m. And um, you will not be disappointed, okay? Try them for yourselves. Tell them Screaming Chewy sent you. And um, I'd like to thank Juanito here, being co-host. And uh, how many time, bro? Have my back, you had the info right on. Bam, I'm all worried. What would <laughs> I got you, man. So, Desert Daiquiris, and uh, don't forget to hit them up. And um, yeah, like I said, uh, you know, there's much, much more flavors, and uh, we're excited to try them as well. Definitely. So shout out to Jeremy for letting us to bring these here that we can taste them and you know promote them. But mostly because you know he cooked it up with the really really good ones. I'm pretty sure. Um, I mean I'm impressed. I mean I really don't drink daiquiris, but I think from now on it's gonna be my thing. But it's probably just gonna be coming from desert daiquiris from now on. Desert daiquiris. I mean, amazing. Uh, like I said, oh, I might have, I might have another drink of it. I've been just sipping in between like you. Uh, and it's so freaking hot outside, man. It's just for those people that are listening that are not from Arizona, I think it's like about like 90 degrees at nighttime. Like, we're in October and it's still 100 degrees in the day. Yeah. It was yeah, just today it was 100 degrees. You, know? you wake up sweating at 12 to midnight. Yeah, if you don't have AZ, you're going to be miserable. I'm AC. I don't know why I say AZ. Because Arizona. I'm saying Rona, AC, Rona, AC. AC. Yeah. <laughs> All calls getting to me. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> but um, I'd like to thank again um, Jeremy. Um, great guy, very innovative. This is, uh, you got some, you got a great thing going on here, man. Everybody hit him up. Desert Daiquiris. And uh, this episode is brought to you by them. So, peace. <laughs>